everyone welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here so for today's video i'm going to be doing my sinking funds update for the end of april 2021 so what we're going to do is we're just going to go through our binders here and we're going to count the money that's in each of our envelopes and we're just going to tally it up for the month and see how much we have grown and excuse me for my voice for some odd reason i don't know it's just really raspy today and i have no idea why so let's get started with the video. So here I have all of my sinking funds listed here. And we're gonna start with this yellow binder first. All right, so we're gonna count what we have in emergency fund. And let's see what we have. So an emergency fund, we have 100, 200, yeah, 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 400, yeah, 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 600. So that's $600. We have 610, 620, 2530, 3540, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. So right now we have $650 in our emergency fund, which is so awesome to me. I'll be reaching my initial 1000 pretty soon and it's so exciting so the next envelope is savings and we have 50 70 80 90 100 110 20 30 40 45 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 so we have 160 dollars in our savings which is awesome as well so we have $160 so we don't have anything in extra debt as of right now so in family vacation family vacation has 100 200 300 400 500 600 20 40 60 80 This is all over the place. What in the world? Okay. Don't know how that happened, but. All right, so we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 800. And we have 810, 820, 830, 840, 45, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62, 63. So we have $863 in our family vacation. And this one is coming along nicely as well. So we have $860. I'm telling y'all, today has just been a whirlwind day. So we have $863. Medical has... 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. So we have $41 in medical. $41. Birthdays has 10, 20, 25, 30, 35. So we have $35 in birthdays. Self-care has only a dollar, I think. So we have one dollar in self-care. Which, that little one dollar means something as well. So, my vacation has 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. So, I have $50 in my vacation. So 
50. Family time has five, 10. So there's $10 in family time. $10. In Christmas, we have 50, 70, 80, 90, 100. 110, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. So we have $150 in our Christmas fund, which is good for now. We're gonna beef that up after a while. We don't count this on camera. So we're gonna move on to our pink binder. So my mom's envelope has See what she's got. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 25, 30. So my mom has $130 in her envelope. So 130. This is my oldest nephew. His name is Knowledge. He has 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47. Yep. So he has 47 in his envelope. $47. Nyla has... 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. So Nala has $55. So she's got 55. My nephew Princeton, he has 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. So he has $40 in his envelope. And last but not least, my baby niece, Nasaya, has 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. So Nasaya has $55. Sam's Club has... 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So we have $40 in Sam's Club and I just need five more dollars and I'll have my renewal fee for next year. But I'm gonna keep stuff in that because I want to go do a little shopping. So retirement is next and in retirement we have 10, 15, 20, 21, 22. So we have $22 in our retirement fund. Student loans has 10, 15, 20. So we have $20 in student loans. So $20. So um, in tech, we have 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I have 26 in tech. $26. Our giving envelope has only five. Yeah, so five dollars in giving. I actually just did a giveaway, so um, we're just gonna beef this one back up again. Our miscellaneous has 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So miscellaneous has $25. And then down below, um, 
taxes doesn't have anything neither this moving and it's not in this binder it's in another binder but i don't feel like pulling it out so yeah so that's it for that so what we're gonna do is we're going to add all of these up together plus So the total that we're coming up with is 2425 and if you, last month's total for March was, $2,335, yeah. So, okay, so for the end of April, we have $2,425, which is good. So that is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I was all over the place, I know, because I kind of confused myself as I was counting. But, you know, we got it all taken care of. But yeah, make sure you like the video, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, and hit the post notification bell. So you will be notified whenever I post another video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.